Hello, hello, and welcome back to Seven Days to Die. Now, uh, I mentioned in the last episode that... Uh, where is this quest? Infestation. We're doing the infestation quest. Uh, that my level went back to one, and all of my recipes that I learned from magazines were lost. Um, that was actually because of a update to the game. Uh, I read the patch notes and it said that uh, player level may uh, be reverted back to level 1. Um, so that's just something that, you know, you, you gotta kind of accept if you're playing on experimental. I chose to play on experimental and I just gotta accept it now. I don't have to accept it. Uh, what I did was... I gave myself... Oh, I'm level 20 now. I gave myself enough XP through the console here uh, to get to level 19, which is where I was when I left off. And uh, I think I gained another, another level. I must have punched some zombies or something. And I gave myself 8 magazine boxes to get some of my uh, crafting skills back. So if we look at crafting skills, I, I gave myself, I think, eight boxes. And so I got some of my crafting skills back from that. Not a whole lot, really. Because uh, I took a lot of magazines from the traders, but I lost all that. So that's all I did. That's all I gave myself. Um, I don't want to, you know, cheat myself out of the experience, so I didn't do any more than that. That's all I did, and that should bring me about back to where I was, and I think I've spent all of my skill points here. Yeah, I spent all my skill points on, um, I think there were the same skills I had before, more or less, mostly in fortitude. All right, so we're back to where we were more or less. And we're going to try this infestation quest. Now, I want to try it before it gets too late, because... Oh, chicken. Um, that. Oh boy, did it start? It started. They're coming. Oh, that guy won't go down. Yeesh. Oh, I, do I hear a dog? Oh, please, no. Hi there. What? Just, uh... Yeesh. Clear the infested area. No problem. I guess uh, infested means there's just more zombies than usual. Now, with every update they make to the game... Uh, especially when it's in experimental... They do recommend that you... Start a new world. Um, I'm not gonna do that. But, uh, I do recognize that... Things may go a little wonky if I keep playing this world and uh, we keep progressing in game versions. Um, 
if something happens to where it gets unplayable or whatever, then I'll restart. But I'm going to try to keep going as long as I can. And if something breaks, well... I've got no right to complain about it. Oh, any birds? No birds. We got a lumberjack. Holy cow. That was like a critical hit. You see the way he flew? Launched him into the air. Oh, we got military zombies. God. Punching his armored head is like punching a brick. Return to the trader. Oh, that's it. Infested cash. Nice. Uh, now... I was right last episode. Hey, buddy. Oh, I'm I'm gonna leave here. I gotta get back to the trader. Um, I was right when I said that I was on a tier three quest for Jen, but uh, I think she didn't give me a tier three quest last time, simply because I was uh, level one when I got this infestation quest. So now that I'm level 19, or 20, I guess, let's see. If she can give me a level three quest. We've got the best prices in the wasteland. I know, your prices are great. Um, don't need the flashlight mod. Don't need sawed off shotgun. I guess I'll take the 9mm ammo. It might be handy. Oh, still tier 2 quests. Alright, we'll do a tier 2 infested clear. Someone to handle the Thanks, son. I knew you wouldn't let me down. Can I do this at night? Well, that's a shame. I guess we gotta do a few more tier 2 quests for her. I'm a little afraid to do this at night, though. God, it's day 11 already. We're going to have a horde night soon. How's my mushrooms doing? Mushrooms. Oh, I got one seed back. I threw it on the ground. Can I make seeds yet? Nah. Level 16. Oh, I got a hobo stew. Structural brace mod. Um, let's put that in our shovel. That thing wears out pretty quick when we're digging big holes. Uh, put that away. Scrap boots. I can sell that. Let me put that in here. 
Bobo stew. Food 64. Holy cow. Now that I lost uh, all my recipes, what can I cook? I can... Oh, I can't cook bacon and eggs anymore. Bummer. I gotta find more magazines. Alright, my armor is damaged. Can I repair it? Yeah, I need a repair kit. Repair. All right, there we go. Uh, Fireman's Almanac, use it. Let's repair that. Repair our bone knife. Okay. Um. Maybe I should work on my house here a little bit. Or, I mean, I, I don't think you could call it a house <laughs> by any definition. But uh, I need a roof. Um, can I make glass blocks? How to do? Well, it's done in a forge. It takes all sorts of stuff. Stone, lead, iron, clay, sand. Bulletproof. Oh, that's bulletproof glass. Okay. Regular glass block. Because I want a sunroof. Where is my lead? Lead. Alright, we're smelting lead here. There, just put all that in. Get, up, get that all smelted. Here, we'll do it this way. There we go. No, not all of it. Get those going. Um, what do I need? Stone for it. Let's see, if I want cement... I need a cement mixer. That's done in a cement mixer. Workstation level 30. Oh, great. Okay, that's not happening. I think I just gotta get more... more magazines. Now, what is this? This is new. For the farm plot. Fertile level. Does that mean I can get more product from... from growing uh, plants on more fertile... Plots? Hmm. Yeah, it'll be a while before I can get my sunroof. Uh, I need glass. 
last blocks. Um, let me get some nitrate powder. I need to make some more farm plots. Nitrate powder is the thing that I need. Now over here, I've got a mine for iron and lead. That's what it's supposed to be. A mine for iron and lead. Uh, over here we got nitrate. Let's go digging around. Can I even make a real pickaxe? Nope. Harvesting tools, 11. I should have gave myself more magazines. That's okay. We'll survive. We'll see how painful this will be. Mining with my stone axe. Oh, I went too far. Getting a lot of nitrate, that's good. I don't need a whole lot, I just need enough for a few farm plots. How much do they take? 25 each. could use the clay too. Yeah, I just really don't want to do the infested quest at night. Even though it's a tier 2. Uh, they're going to hit me with running soldier zombies. All kinds of nasty stuff. So far, no uh, radiated zombies. I think the next Horde Night, day 14, I'm pretty much going to do the same thing as last time. I might start like a Horde base before then. But it won't be ready in any way for the next Horde Night. Let's get a little bit more nitrate. One thing I need to do more of is uh, harvest uh, corpses. They'll give me some uh, rotten, rotten meat, rotten flesh, and a little bit of nitrate too. 
I gotta remember to do that. Alright, let's head back. I gotta eat my hobo stew. I wonder, did I, did I also lose all of my known schematics? Uh, no, I guess not. I can still make clothing pockets, or maybe you always could, I don't know. Hmm. Well, let me search for mod. Yeah, I can't make any mods except shotgun, duckbill mod. Maybe I did lose all of my known mods. Yeah, I must have because I had the gravedigger mod. I, I knew how to make that, I think. Ah, well, that's all right. See a deer. Stop moving. What? That went right through him. There we go. Alright, let's grab a bite to eat. Hobo stew. Delicious. And what do we need for farm plots? Rotting flesh. Well, we can make five of them. I'm so bummed that I can't make bacon and eggs anymore. Okay, we gotta wait for that to finish. One minute to finish the farm plots. I want to make a farm. I guess I can make it sort of between my base and the house here. Yeah, maybe in this area. It's a good spot. As good as any. Uh, let's grab... I 
our other farm plots and then grab... Do I have any shapes? No, they would be in here. Block. No. Shape. Yeah, okay, move my bike a bit. All right, I want it. Now this is going to seem silly. I want it perfectly diagonal. From my pole here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Perfect. Oh, no, I don't want to do that. Yeah, no, 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 that's fine. Um, we'll put the farm plot down. Okay. Okay, now the shape. I want to use these shapes. Um, at what? No. Just seeing what looks interesting. I want something on the floor to kind of hide the the way the ground slopes there. Um, plate. Wow, look at all these crazy shapes. So many. Too bad I have zero creativity. My base would look awesome. But nope. With my base you get this. A perfect square with perfectly evened out pillars with stairs in the middle. Zero creativity whatsoever. And it's beautiful. Okay, so that's what the farm will look like when it's filled out. We'll have farm plots all across here. 
and here, and then if we want, we can extend it even further. Let's plant something. Thought I heard footsteps. I think it was my own. Sometimes my own footsteps freak me out. This game is really good at um, atmosphere. It's just at night, the sound levels of the zombies are pretty much perfect. Like, you think you hear them, but you're not sure. I got hops. Pumpkin. Alright, we're not going to be able to plant all of these, obviously. Corn is good. Uh, what is that? Yucca? Yes. We can use that. Um, I want the hop. Pumpkin. Coffee. Goldenrod. Now, I got a little farm over here. It might be ready to harvest now. Let's have a look. Yeah, there we go. There's always um, farm plots here as well that I can take advantage of. And I will. Uh, but I just like to have something closer to my base as well. Alright, let's uh, replant what we can. There we go, that works. Now we get back fewer seeds than what we start with. Coffee beans. Five. It takes five to make a seed. Okay, so I think um, it takes, say, five coffee beans to make a seed. But we don't get that much when we harvest. So it's a net loss. Unless we specialize in... Living off the land? Is that it? Double the harvest of wild or planted crops. Well, darn. I should have got that before I harvested. I don't have any skill points, so I couldn't anyway. But um, before my plants here are ready, I'm going to get that skill. I'm going to put a point in there. Double your harvest. That's one of those that uh, pretty much everyone should get. Uh, at least one point in that. It's so... You get so much for just one skill point. And I like that. I like that they do that. That you could get so much for um, so little investment to start with for the first level. But uh, if you want higher, like you want to specialize, then uh, it's going to cost a lot more, obviously. So that makes it possible to create a sort of well-rounded character that can do... Um, not really do everything, but has some skill in a little bit of everything. Uh, a little bit of farming and, you know, whatever. All right, um, yucca fruit. I want to make some yucca juice. Please tell me I can make yucca juice. I can't. Well, that's a shame. 
I think I just have to grind quests. I need more magazines. Tier 2 infestation. What is this nonsense? It's out in the middle of nowhere. Is there a building here? Or is it just this region is infested? Oh no, there's a... There's a mine here. Funny, it's a tier 2 infestation, but the... POI is tier 1. I guess that's the way it works. It's a tier 2 quest, but... The infestation quests are in... POIs that are 1 level lower. Oh, come around. Oh, jeez. Granny. Here, eat fist. No, Granny, I told you. I'm not coming to visit. I had enough of your crap. Oh god. Oh, we got ferals. Yeesh. Should have stayed down. All right, any more grannies in here? Oh, you'll have to do. Ah, whoa. It's an awkward uh, animation transition when they go from standing to uh, kneeling or crawling. I can make yucca. Yucca juice. Oh, jeez. Last one. And we get a infested cache. Uh, good. Yes, I need ammo. That's very good. Alright. I got a few magazines too, which is great. I just need more and more of those. Uh, we got a woodcutter. Let's put our woodcutting wood splitter mod in here. 15% more damage against wood. Okay, so I'm going to go turn this in. I'll probably do another quest or two offline just 
Well, how do I get out of here now? No. Ah, here we go. Uh, yeah, I'll do another quest or two just to see if I can get more magazines because that's going to really hurt me if I can't craft all this stuff. And uh, I'll do that off camera. And uh, we're getting close to the next Horde Night. And I think I'm going to spend it on the roof of the gas station again. And I, I'm i thinking I probably will die this time. <laughs> oh boy. But hey, we got a little farm going. We're still making progress. Slowly but surely, we'll get there. <laughs> 